Hi, I'm Mark Tour, and welcome back to video number three of the Shocking Truth video series. I started out in video number one actually talking about the shocking truth in the state of the automotive industry. First of all, good times are back. People are selling cars. Uh, things are looking good. Profits are up. Everybody's feeling better after three years in the doldrums. And that's awesome, and you should be optimistic. But one thing I know is if you don't have a good foundation in your business, no matter what the marketplace, no matter what the economy is, it's not going to matter. You will begin to crumble. You will not get your fullest extent of the profits and the sales that you should. It always is based upon a great foundation. We call it the 4P foundation. People, process, product, and market positioning. I talked about people in the last video and I'm going to talk about process today. Let me give you an example. I just left two different dealerships last week, which I do consulting with, and in reviewing their processes, here's what I found. They, like most dealerships, don't have written, formalized, and communicated and actualized processes for just about anything in their dealership. I'm talking about what is your deal process when a customer is there at the dealership? Is it written down as to what you will do? Do you execute it? Do you check to make sure that it's executed? What do you do on an annual basis to find out what you're doing to make sure that it's working? Do you have an inventory process? Do you know what you're going to buy, where you're going to buy it, how you're going to buy it, what your models are, how that might change every 90 days? If this is not written, actualized, and reviewed, you're going to find that you're buying the wrong inventory without a plan. I find that we don't have a plan often for how we're going to recruit, hire, train, and retain people. That's what I talk about in processes. You should have a process for how your cars get cleaned and how they get detailed and how you know that they're cleaned and detailed to a written process and how you're going to check that. In other words, every single thing that occurs, whether it's your desking process, your deal process, your inventory process, your one-on-one -on -one coaching process. What do you do with your salespeople every single day to personally develop them? I'm not talking about just checking their numbers of how many customers they had, how many they closed, how many they wrote up or demoed, or what their marketing prospecting plan, but what is their personal development process? Do you have that and do you do that? Most dealerships don't. 98% of dealerships I've seen Thousands of dealerships do not have a written, formalized, actualized plan for this. What about your save-a-deal process? Every single morning, as managers, do you review yesterday's traffic to know who came in, what happened, the internet leads, who was closed, where the deals are at, are they approved or not approved, what is your contracts in transit, what are your heat sheet items like missing steps, etc. Most people talk about doing this, but it's not formalized and done every single day. Success is about successful habits. What will you do every single day? And that takes process. If you want to see a successful business in any industry, look at what their processes are. Look at, are they written? Are they actualized? Are they reviewed? Are they being executed every single day and reviewed to make sure that you can make it better? In other words, I always say in a little saying that you got to quantify to qualify. Quantify what you're doing to qualify it and make it better. If you want to find out how to take your dealership to another level than you've ever seen before, make more sales, more profit, more return on investment, more yield, I want you to go to a website. I want you to go to tuart.com slash shocking truth. That's T-E-W-A-R-T dot com slash shocking truth. Or you can call us at 888-223-9278. Thanks a lot and make sure you start looking at your processes.